Hey guys, this is Ryan Blair here at Halo Inc. And today I am showing you a design improvement. And this is on our apparel proofing templates. Um, so the improvement was adding these text boxes to our color options for shirts. So if we had multiple colors on the same style garment with the same design, uh, we could proof them out by changing the colors down here. Um, so these black squares did already exist. Um, and so we needed a way to represent how many sizes were going with that color. Um, so I put in these uh, gray strips right here with some, some text in it that you could replace. So let's say this was a medium, two, large, three. And if you needed more, then you could just slide it over to XL, five. And let's say that that was it. So the way that we were doing it before, let me uh, pop over to our older template. When you turn on those color options, um, so we have different amounts of color options, so they all essentially look the same. Um, but you can see once we have, oops, once we have additional placements on there, um, what we would do is we would go ahead and copy some text and we do medium to large five so on and so forth. And we were just kind of sticking them above these color swatches, but you could see that there isn't a whole lot of space. So once you started laying it out, you kind of had to change the size of the drops, which obviously there, there becomes issues with that. And it just wasn't consistent, it wasn't a standard. Um, so again, we went ahead and put those in there. And what that was doing for us is it reduced the uh, motion, the moving the, um, the moving the mouse around, it reduced transportation, moving around the, the text and the other squares, as well as the, the over-processing because none of that is adding value to the customer. So yeah, that's my improvement for the day. Thanks for watching.